What is going on, fellas? Welcome back to another video. It's the day, the day we are doing so much. Moving our ducks from the original PC Farm, VZ Kids Farm, over to the new PC Farm 2.0. We're also getting my pig's house built because we're moving the pigs in today. The vet's also coming. We have an appointment for a mango because his tusks are getting so big. This is a mass of A lot of animal stuff going down today. Busy day. Can't wait to share it with you guys. I got my boy Brent in here. Time to catch some, some birds. Birds, and of course, we got the VZ kids here hey. to help as well. This is a helping job because these ducks are not easy to catch. We don't have a net, we don't have plywood like we originally planned to trap them into a corner. It's time to literally go in there and grab these things, catch these birds by hand. Oh, I went over to Walmart and I got a cage, dog cage. Thing was like 80 bucks. Don't worry, we'll return it because you're broke. <laughs> Sorry. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to, you can cut that. My bad, I shouldn't have said that. It's just that we gotta take it back, cause we gotta This thing should fit all the ducks. I mean, they're just gonna huddle into one corner anyway. We're taking Gary, bunch of Pekins. I got some call ducks in there. I got Gucci gang from Blake. What else can I say other than let's get to it? Anthony, grab ducks. What ducks? The white ones. Start with the white ones. You're coming home, stop swimming away. This one, right there. <laughs> grab him. Dive on him. Get him, Brenton. Oh my goodness. That's one of ours. No, that's the other one. That's our duck, dude. <laughs> well, Ryan is here. She's going to make sure you guys know which. Uh -oh. It's time to get in, bro. Uh -oh. This is I'm wasting time sitting here. Uh oh, oh he took off the shoes. Oh no. Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? What do you think you can't see? All right. You got two, He's scratching bro. me. Ow, dude, stop. Oh my god. He just pooped on me. Two ducks down. I'm gonna go for a straight swan dive. I have zero faith, Paul. Zero faith. Zero faith. Watch this. I think Brent is gonna do a better job than you, honestly. Brent swan dive at the same time. Oh! Oh! Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I really didn't mean to scare the duck. But I had to get him somehow. Swan dove under. And I swam and found it. <laughs> Brandon's carrying it like a baby. <laughs> Look at this thing. That's a straight up definition of Aflac right there. <laughs> Aflac. Four down, 24 more gonna go. Go. What did he just <laughs> say? No! Where'd he go? Where is it? Oh! <laughs> so that's dope. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> Three? Yeah. <laughs> That's a good way to do it right there. Jeez. Oh, holy moly. Look at the red ants on me right now, dude. You kind of stun them when you just grab them from underneath because they can't really do much. It's okay. Have fun, guys. You'll be home shortly. This is a workout. You ain't getting away. You ain't getting away. There you go, boy. Yeah! Good job, Anthony. That was a pain. That was hard, bro. It's time to get the beast, oh. Gary. Get him! No! Oh, he's alone. He's alone. He's, he's alone. alone. He's Come on. This is your time. Oh! All right, what a legend, an absolute legend. Oh, oh. he just straight sucked me in the face. Oh, Brinson oh. got some too. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, everyone. Thank you, Brenton. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Anthony. Good job. All right. I ordered on Amazon a 35 foot long seine net to sain this entire pond out. So we're literally gonna get a net. Brenton will be on that side, I'll be on this side, and all the VZ kids will be in the middle. And we're just gonna walk the net through this entire pond and get all the pock through. They're probably triple the size they were. There's even other stuff like peacock bass in here. There's all sorts of stuff in this pond that we're gonna get when we sain it. So make sure to subscribe and don't miss that video. It's already ordered, it comes from China though, so it's gonna be a while. Hey buddies.
You guys got so big. How you doing, Batman? And look at that. We got Willow and Daddy Pig right there. The hogs. What's going on, hogs? This enclosure is all soaking wet, but they are hogs. They love it. Hey, buddies. We're here at the PC Farm 2.0, and it's time to get all the ducks into the pond. This is the first of many animal things we're doing today. Come on. Everyone go. Your new home. Come on. Go, 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 go. Gary's out. We're gonna go straight to the water. All your friends. All your friends. All your friends. Yeah. Dude, that's sick. It has been months and months and I'm literally sweating. So long. We've been waiting for this moment right here. Smash the like button. Gary and the fam are home. We finally have ducks. And this enclosure is way bigger. It's much more large. It might not look like it, but it is. It's got so much more bank space. We can get a lot more ducks. The pond might not be as big, but it's definitely neater. I love it. Deeper. 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 Yeah. It is deeper. Although it all fills in, especially you saw in the last video. Look at all the ducks. Look at them all. Love and life. Fresh, clean water. Daily. 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 See that? Fresh water pouring in right there. Hey, Gary. Oh my gosh. We have ducks here at the house. Squat up. Squat up, baby. That's so crazy. They're all cleaning themselves off. Some cold ducks. We got Gary, the Chinese goose. Looks good. The pond's gonna fill up even more now that I turn the water back on. This cage was brand new. Um, it doesn't look too brand new anymore. Ducks like to poop a lot. I hate how the wire looks up against the post like this. So what I've been doing is actually just putting a piece of wood, two screws, and just covering how it looks. You see what I'm saying? I love that look a lot better than that look. So we're gonna put one of these pieces of wood right there. Backyard work, getting things done. Right there. Like that. So much better. Now you see this compared to this. The other one looks a lot better. So I've got more wood up here to then do this one as well. Hector will be here tomorrow to build the pig house, which will also be in this video. But for today, we got a lot done. The ducks are home. This is how I walk my ducklings over to the pond. Just get a little five gallon bucket. You guys ready to go for a swim? Come on, little ones. There you go. There you go. There you go, big boy. Two more. And look who's left, Pinky. Now let them hang out in the pond and uh, relax for a little bit. Learn how to swim, become a real duck. Speaking about ducks, look who's here. Look at them all, come out of the duck house, come on. Yeah. Gary, it's great to have you here. Of course, you're welcome, you're welcome Gary. I know it's beautiful, it's much larger. This is the first yeet. Oh yeah. You gotta really like yeet it here to get it over to the pond, it's further. Ducks are eating and the enclosure is fully set up. These guys are being moved today over to here. And Hector is here building a massive pig house. Biggest one I think we've ever made. Hector, yes, this is the biggest one we've ever made, right? 10 by eight? Yeah, this is the biggest one. So as you can see, lots of wood. Things are always getting done around here. A house will be built right there. Ducks are moved, it's time to build a pig house. Mango, you got a vet appointment today. 1.30, buddy. Those big old tusks are gonna get shaved because they're growing back into his cheek. I gave him his meds yesterday and the vet will then come today and then Mango is feeling nice and fresh. This house is huge, let me tell you. Wow. I love building these homes. Although they're very expensive, these things are the best for the animals. They're very sturdy. They can make it through pretty much any storm. They have four of these four by fours right here that go into the ground on all four corners. Actually, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven four by fours that are going in the ground. Keeps the animals safe, dry, shaded. Can't beat them. He manhandles that thing. Mango's getting his tusks done right now. Hector. 
<laughs> Mango, it was needed to be done, all right, bud? There's the second one. That's a big one. Getting the hoof trimming, got his tusks trimmed. They're just checking out his belly because he has a little swellness, but I think it's good. He's also getting a cleaning, like a facial. This is a mass of some kind. So it feels a little squishy and fatty. It's probably just a big, ugly, fatty mass. It is always an adventure here at the PC Farm. He's like, dude, my face feels amazing. Now he has like this ulcerated spot above his eye yep. from having fat forehead. Yep. And he's on a weight loss diet, and he's lost a lot of weight, and we're just gonna watch him lose more, and that's gonna go away. Oh, looking good, Hector. Look how big this thing is. All of mine around the entire farm match. All of them match. This one will be the same exact color. Mango's a happy camper, as you can see. Both him and Lady Mae both got their faces cleaned, their ears wiped, and they probably feel like a million bucks right now. Green color ready. What is that? Como dicen los Mexican, quedó chingona, papá. Just like that, Hector is done with the house. It's larger than any other house we've ever built for the animals. It looks absolutely amazing. I got some shavings to go inside, but right now we gotta move all the pigs over. Now this could go one of two ways. It can go either really good, the pigs will all just walk right over, or they're just gonna scatter around the yard and it is gonna be a shit show. So it's one of the two. I'm hoping it's the first one. Let's see what happens. That's what I call trained pigs right there. That takes some work. Look at them all in their new house. Now there's two more over there. They're getting a little bit of the food that came out while I was shaking it. All right, one more. This is I feel like how it always goes. This will be like the hard one. Like she's not gonna cooperate, she'll run around. This enclosure is so much bigger that all the pigs literally looks like there's none. Baloo's going to check out the crib. Yep. Got their water bowl, got their food. So literally all the pigs are in here. It's much, much bigger of an area. As you can see, they're all still eating the food that I put down there. And it looks like Mama is digging through the brand new grass, which of course she's doing because Lulu loves fresh grass. Right, Lily? You like the fresh grass. Oh. Wanted to make sure that was in before I moved over the pigs, but now everything's on this side besides the ducks. That's an empty enclosure. Who knows what we'll do with that. Thank you all so much for watching. We got the ducks home, we transferred the pigs, and we also built the pigs a nice big old house. Smash the subscribe button if you're new. Smash the like button, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.